Today we're doing Hour of Code, where the kids get to bring out all of the different technology that we have in class and spend an hour coding. We're really trying to get them to be interested in this degree in the future, and we want them to go to Data and to Roosevelt to participate with technology. We're teaching students here basically the basic tenets of coding, um, basic steps, how to repeat them, and basically how to attach everything to get to a goal. Problem solving is one of the things that is the biggest struggle that we have because they're good at doing like one step things mm -hmm. um, but anytime that there's more than one step it's like no that's too hard I gotta stop right there. Mm -hmm. um, so anything where they're doing things where they have to find a solution to a problem that isn't just one thing and I'm done um, that helps their problem solving and that helps in every subject. It's a way of thinking and so with these simple activities they uh, kind of gets them in that mindset so they can actually start programming later. Students use um, iPads to go to code.org and do different games like Star Wars games, Angry Birds, Moana, and they're programming the computer. You're using code to move them around and try to get to the end. There's a lack of women in the field so we really try to promote the girls doing coding. That's why I have my code at like a girl shirt <laughs> so that they'll get into it too. My favorite part about this is that we get to move around different places even though if we get it wrong we get multiple chances to try it again. Being Computer Science Education Week, this is a really good time for us to incorporate all the time that they get to spend doing this and all the stuff that we do in a classroom and kind of start to put it together. I'm good at coding.